digestion, and it may even act as a decongestant if you happen to catch a cold. Love it. Okay, are there other herbs that we should be eating? Well, one other one I want to tell you about, Colleen, is gaining more interest in the medicinal field. And this is turmeric, which evidence is mounting now over its antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties. But you first want to check with your doctor about your own personal circumstances because taking a standardized supplement of about 500 milligrams three times a day of turmeric may help with the symptoms of arthritis and even colitis. Wow. Now, apart from supplements, there are also benefits to cooking with herbs and spices because they are a healthy alternative to salt as seasoning. It also helps lower fat and sugar intake by adding flavor to your foods. Cooking encourages variety in your food intake, which may help you get more balanced nutrients, and it also makes vegetables more appetizing. Appetizing. Now, we know that higher vegetable intake is associated with improved health and disease prevention. And for sure, Colleen, this is where everyone's been asking me about all the benefits of mowed wine and also hot apple cider cinnamon. Well, better that than with the eggnog. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> Tasty, too. Yeah, exactly. All right. Thanks so much, Doctor. Let's check in with Mark, who's downstairs with a look at our weather forecast. Mark? Uh, it looks a, a little bit wet. Got the umbrella out. There's a little bit of light rain, but uh, not enough. Uh, there's more.